Hello and welcome to a server owner tutorial for Epic Skyblock plugin. This is a newer plugin and it is currently on, ser on version 1.14.2 and it goes down to version 1.8. So when you first start, you're going to do a slash island create or slash island help and island create will take you to this island right here. This is your island, you can add your friends if you want, but this is yours. Now we're gonna go through the we're gonna go through the sections and I'll help you on through. Right now these are the player commands. Not so much for owner, but this is still good to know. Here you just did island home that teleports you to the spawn of your island. Now if you go and do Island Delete, it's going to go and get rid of all of your blocks and just send you into the void for you to die. Once you revive, you'll end up in the normal world and you can create your island again. Yep, here we are. Let's create that island again. And here we go. Generating. And boom, you got your island back. <coughs> Now that we've done that, we're going to go ahead and test out the regen. Now this does, it's supposed to reset your island to a default state. Watch this, I'm going to type the command again. And not only did it fill up that spot, but it also took back the dirt block that I mined. Alright, now that we've done gen, let's go and check out the missions. Missions are like quests. You, If you do a certain amount of things, you get crystals. These crystals can be used for boost and other fun stuff. These island crystals are a unique currency for this plugin. As far as I know, it cannot be used in other plugins, but you may be able to talk to the uh, developer, creator of this epic Skyblock plugin. And here you see you can do some increases like the size of your land, you can also increase the amount of members that can be on it or even increase the amount of warps you can have on your island. Right here you can improve your island generator that is provided by the server owner in schematics folder. Here you can see we have a fully working chest, the normal stuff that is on any Skyblock survival island. After upgrades, we'll check out boosters. These are more things that you can spend your crystals on. You can increase your mobs, you can increase crops, experience, and over here on the right, you can increase the amount of fly time on your island. You currently start off with zero, but you know you can spend crystals to upgrade that. And this allows fly without getting VIP. I don't even have essentials plugged in. So I'm doing DOP here to show that I am not currently Opt. These are all things that normal players can do. If I had purchased the flight booster, I would be able to fly right now. Let's go more into these crystals. Now, as you saw before, you can get more crystals with the booster, with the missions. Right now I'm testing out the crystals command. This is what everyone can use. Now as you can see here, when you use the crystals command, it does not give you the ability to add crystals. That is why the give crystals command is there. And remove crystals does the complete opposite. Those two are only usable by staff members who have been given the correct permissions. This plugin is called Epic Skyblock, created by Peaches MLG. 
and that's what the about tells you. It tells you who it's about, what the plugin name is, and the version of the plugin. That'll help if you need to know if you have an update or not. All right, let's take a look at the next one. That will be top. That shows the top players islands. I'm currently number one because I'm the only player. As you saw, it, it popped up GUI, had my head there. It said the ranking and the value. So let's take a look at the border. This one will allow us to change the color of the border. If you watch the background really fast, you can see right here, this is one color. Watch as I change it. Boop. You see, it changed. Watch again. Boop. It changed. Boop. It got darker. It changed. Or did it? You may not really know it, but it did. You could set your island to public, meaning anyone can join, or you could set it to private, which means no one can join. This would be through the warps. So yeah, this is my server. As you can see here, I am running version 1.14.4. I'm sorry for being a little bit behind, but it still will work in 1.14.4. And the earliest version it will work in is 1.8. You can find this plugin at Spigot. The link will be in the description below. And I want to thank you all so much for watching my video. It means a lot to me. And I hope that this will help you as a server owner be able to help your players have fun. So please sit back and relax while I kill myself over and over again, as I'm sure all of your players will do after finding out that deaths will teleport you back home. See you!